losing one. If you're watching this video right now, I have a message for you. But before I start, let's do 21 deep breaths in through our nose, out through our mouths, okay? Let's begin. Ready, set, go. Seven, come on into your nose, out through your mouth, but not all the way. Let's go. When you exhale through your mouth, you're actually releasing bacteria. But if you inhale through your mouth, you're actually inhaling bacteria. I know, right? Mm. But who would have thought? Let's let's continue. I like to really focus on the breath. Really inhale. Just about done okay i probably did a little extra but it's all good because it's always good to do extra so see what i'm saying if you ever feel any amount of tension anger frustration emotional irritability feel anything do this technique right now so right now i want us to declutter ourselves we're gonna flush off any unwanted stagnation that has been persisting on our energetic aka our physical body because everything on the energy is on the physical all right this is what this does all right so we're gonna release everything and release it we're gonna ground ourselves because as we amplify we have to be able to be able to understand that the earth is like separate between high and low so if you hold on to the low things where does that make you you kind of split because part of you will be in the higher dimensions of course but the other part of you physically still holds on to the past because the past technically is energetically still persistent on you. You got to understand that. So it's good to flush all the time. So that's what this does. So hold on. Let's do a couple good stretches to stretch our anchor ourselves in the Earth's frequency because as the geomagnetic solar storms, as they continue to amplify and increase, you want to release those old doors. I mean, close the old doors, a.k.a. release stagnation, a.k.a. detoxify. That way, you can increase your vibration. I know, right? I think you increase your vibration by doing this technique, all right? And this is going to do a number of other things, like fix your health, you know what I'm saying, decrease disease, also build immunity, also endorphins, serotonin. I'm talking all of them. Theta, gamma, everything. I know you're feeling a lot of anxiety. I know you're feeling much more than you should be feeling right now. And plus, don't let me get on the fact that people try to, you know, send you spiritual attacks. Like, that is beyond malevolent, if you ever ask me. Like, how dare them? Like, are you kidding me? And you've only done nothing but try to uplift everybody. I bet. But the thing is that people feel threatened by you because you have such as light and you're like main character energy. So people don't like that. People don't like that you're the main character energy. Trust me, if they're really ego, pride, or, you know, heavenly in the lower chakra, then they definitely won't like you because you're in the higher chakra. So it's just polar opposite. So it's just like, you know, it's the, it's the, what's it called? The, uh, ha, what's his name from Smallville? Wait, Luther. Yes, it's Luther to your Superman. It's just, you know, Luther, what's his name? And his dad, Al or no. Kyle or nope, but I don't know. Let me know in the comment section. But I'm saying it's your polar. So you have to understand it's going to be polar opposites. So there's there you you perceive them as nar uh, narcissistic. But in their eyes, they're not. They don't see their own ways. Like people of that, they can't see that their shit stinks. So you always have to maneuver beyond that. You always have to take the L's and take the blame. And, but people have came on your back and called. People have noticed that and called out. You notice that? Because God has sent people to speak on your name because God's like, nah, I'm not going to have you patronize and, and, and disrespect my chosen name. It's just what it is. 
The reason why many are called, but very few are. If you're watching this video, you're chosen. If you resonate with any of the signs, I'll do a video on it. Signs of a higher individual, meaning that you are of uh, anointed God of holy still. All right. No, normally children will be of this, but you you contain it throughout your whole life. So you always live your life in a child state. There's no there's no you transition out of it. You were just like perceiving it as you were when you were like one year old and you're constantly developing new states. That is how you're really supposed to be. But you were contained in like a what we call and then it was compartmentalized and then it kept you from outward like. AKA, why are you sleeping lead paint fillers every night in a box? What do you think that does? It compartmentalizes your brain, plus it's insulated, which is why it's hot. You feel me? So it's constantly keeping you within a region, within a region, within another region. So you have to break out of that with will and awareness. So I'm telling you, right, right now is the main focus. And that is what these last couple of years has been doing. It's been breaking you out of your old shell. Out of those old periods, it's basically been put into the front for test after test. So that way you can increase just no different than a diamond. I'm telling you, it's like so it allowed individuals, it allowed things to persist because this was synchronous. It was divine. So that way you can grow. So that's why you are worthy of what is about to come to you. Do you not realize greatness? So just continue to be thanking, thanking the ancestors being grateful, showing as much gratitude in this moment and every moment to the next because there is so much that's being done for your forefront, okay? So congratulations, you passed the test. Yes, you passed the test. It was a test and you passed. I know it's been obstacle after obstacle after another obstacle, but guess what? That was just test after test because it's seeing if you're really worth it. God was really seeing if you're really worth it. God didn't want to like, nah, you really worth this blessing. He wanted you to know. That's why I had everything lined up. You think closing those doors is for a reason? You think putting you through pain was for a reason? No. That reason had a season and now you're about to receive your blessing from such. All right? So... That's all I just want to say, y'all. So, man, y'all, just keep holding in there because y'all good, all right? You know what I'm saying? Fasting is good right now. Or I call something different, detoxing. But that's cool because you'll be able to allow yourself to shed those old doors quicker. So it's been on your forefront. It's been for you. Got to understand, this could be chick or feet or dude, all right? Some good shit. All right? I just want to say congratulations, yo. I'm KT, yo. Man, make sure y'all check out the Twitter and the backup channel because you never know. I'm saying I be posting this stuff all the time, but I be talking about all stuff that be happening. I don't know. Maybe y'all need to hear this, all right? So if you came across this video, maybe this is for the divine, uh, God, Christ, you know, whatever you see. I see now the cross basically just means you're standing like this. So it means you're like a man. And then Jesus died at 33 because there's 33 vertebrae. I get it now. It's like everything makes sense.